needs to be kicked, hooks around and slaps it out to a voice. Sloan provided that voice, but couldn't get the footy. Martin emerges with it to Hurley. Dying seconds of the game, down at once full, full of Dickery. Hardigan did well, got a fist in there, off the ground, and the minor score. I think it was Lennon. And Maddie, just to rub salt into the wound, 12 scoring shots is the lowest ever under Dimmer. It's not their lowest score ever, but 12 scoring shots they've never had. So many, so few scoring shots yeah. under Dimmer. Well, it, well, it is a, a concern. Their defence has been great this year, but hitting the scoreboard is uh, is a problem. And going forward, they're going to have to be able to find more goals because you can't be kicking 10 goals every week and winning games. So terrific win for Adelaide. 50,000 people here tonight. It was a bit of a make or break night for the Crows and they have made it in a big way. Back in the eight tonight and with some real hope going into September. What a year it's been for this football club. So difficult in so many ways. A big win tonight. Back in the eight. Now, that, that was a terrific win tonight. You stifled Richmond all over the ground. You've got to be thrilled with that performance. Yeah, we are, mate. Um, after last week, we were very ordinary and we had some meetings during the week, regrouped to come out tonight and do that to a, a, I reckon, a great team. Uh, they've been playing really consistent for you the last month. So to come out there and do that was very pleasing. It was absolutely comprehensive, though, Tex. You smashed them in the middle, contested footy, and just all over the ground, your back six held up beautifully as well. Yeah, I thought our mids were unbelievable tonight. And, um, we got Tails down back, Jakey Levo, Cole Hogan, the boys just stood tall and, and played their role. And a little bit uh, inaccurate, but uh, we'll work on that during the week. Yeah, what's that, 22 points, mate? What, whose boots did you put on tonight? You got any spare ones? <laughs> no, you don't want mine, but geez, uh, that should have been a lot more, really, shouldn't it, in the end? Oh, I'll tell you what, if we kicked 20 to 11, the game would have been over three quarter time, but. It is what it is, and uh, we'll take the four points. Just looking at the big fella there, uh, Sauce in the middle, big, big Sammy Jacobs. He was outstanding. Yeah, I'll tell you what, he reckons he's got sore shoulders because he's been carrying us all year, the big fella. Well done, mate. Uh, he's a lad, Tex, isn't he? He's, he's a lad, Richo, isn't he? <laughs> you say, uh, Sammy, you reckon uh, you've been carrying the team all year, or that's what you've been telling them? Oh, he makes it harder for me. If he kicks those goals, mate, we don't have to do as much, I reckon. <laughs> exactly. Forward slate you down. A bit 11 22, but gee, you did dominate in the middle tonight on the back of your ruck work. Well done on that, but danger was great as well. Yeah, we were, well, the midfield was great all night, and we really got challenged during the week after Sydney really did us in tight last week and probably on the outside. So we had to respond, and um, it's great to put up a really good performance, you know, even though we kicked pretty badly a goal, but to play well for four quarters. You do it on your own pretty much in there, and you had two guys coming at you all night, but you, you seemed to throw on that just wearing your opponents down yeah I guess sometimes you know if you if you chop and change sometimes you can probably break your rhythm a bit sometimes when you're on top you like to keep going so it's probably not a bad thing but um, it's always a challenge every week it's another good one tonight Scotty Camp really tell us about him as a coach it's been obviously a difficult and tough uh, situation for him to be in but just tell us what he's like as a coach yeah he's really good mate he's really tried to continue on Walsh's legacy you'll probably hear the club talk a bit about that but he's been great and um, you know not letting anything as an excuse Excuse. We're here to make finals and that's what we want to do and um, you know we've had a setback with that situation but we moved on and hopefully now we can go on to bigger and better things. 